Tonight, a touching tribute to honor the life and legacy of former First Lady Rosalind Carter. These are brand new photographs of today's service at Glen Memorial Church at Emory University here in Atlanta, where the family, longtime friends, former presidents, and First Ladies shared fond memories of a long life filled with service and love. And it is the second day of services honoring the former First Lady. 11 Alive Savannah Levins was there. It was really a moving tribute here at Glen Memorial Church in Atlanta today. More than 800 people attended this service, including several dignitaries like President Joe Biden, Bill Clinton, Kamala Harris, and all five living first ladies. Perhaps most notable, though, was Rosalind's husband of more than 77 years, former President Jimmy Carter, 99 years old, sitting front row as loved ones recalled their favorite memories and said their goodbyes. I welcome you to this space and this hour as we praise God and give thanks for the life of Rosalind Smith Carter. I will always love my mother. I will cherish how she and dad raised her children that given us such a great example of how a couple should relate. My mom spent most of her life in love with my dad. Because he isn't able to speak to you today, I am going to share some of his words about loving and missing her. My darling, every time I have ever been away from you, I have been thrilled when I returned to discover just how wonderful you are. Imagine all the people. Goodbye, darling, until tomorrow. Jimmy. You, you may say I'm a dreamer. There was also a very moving moment towards the end of the service today where Pastor Loudon thanked the Secret Service members who have been with the Carter family for so long, saying for 43 years, you got Rosalind Carter home safe every time. And if she were here, she would want to say thank you for getting me home safe one last time. Reporting in Atlanta, Savannah Levins, 11 Alive News.